Hello guys, welcome back to another brand new content of civil engineering. Today we will discuss on how we can calculate cement and sand quantity for plastering work. So without getting any further delay, let's get started. Alright, suppose we have a wall of 8 meter length and width or height of 3 meter. Now we have to cover by plastering work in which the thickness of the plaster should be normally 12 mm or 0.012 meter. As we know the plaster is a combined mixture of cement, sand and water. So after waiting with water the motor gets prepared and placed as per our requirement. So the total weight volume comes around 8 meter multiply with 3 meter multiply with 0.012 meter which comes about 0.288 cubic meter now we have to calculate the dry volume as we know that the dry volume of motor contains some certain amount of air and voids in between the particles of fine aggregate so the volume in dry condition is increased up to 30 to 35 percent and roughly we consider as 33 percent increment of dry volume comparison to wet motor volume now the dry volume equals to 1.33 times of wet volume that is 0 0.288 multiply with 1.33 and it comes around 0 0.383 cubic meter so now important point regarding plastering work is here is the list of cement is to sand ratio for different mode of environmental exposure condition as 1 is to 3 ratio of motor we use for external wall in severe climate next 1 is to 4 ratio can be used for external wall in normal condition ceiling plastering concrete wall plastering next one is 1 is to 5 ratio we can use for internal with coarse sand and 1 is to 6 ratio can be used for internal wall with fine sand here in this plaster motor calculation we have considered 1 is to 6 ratio for internal wall plastering work where 1 is the 1 unit of cement and 6 is the 6 unit of sand we have taken. So the total cement plus sand ratio equals to 1 plus 6 which is 7. Now the main concept is quantity calculation. So cement quantity calculation formula equals to 1 by 7 times of dry volume which is 1 divided by 7 multiply with 0 0.383 and it comes about 0 0.0547 cubic meter but we must know that density of cement equals to 1440 kg per cubic meter and weight of one bag of cement equals to 50 kgs so if we multiply with 1440 kg per cubic meter density with 0.0547 then we can get the cement volume as 78.79 kgs and if you divide the 78.79 kg weight with 50 kgs then we can get 1.58 bags of cement for the plastering work now to find out sand quantity for volume of proportion will be as 6 by 7 times of dry volume of motor which is around 0 0.328 cubic meter here you have to again remember that density of sand is approx 1620 kg per cubic meter and 1 cubic meter of volume equals to 35.314 cft volume cft is nothing but cubic feet so therefore, if we multiply 1620 with sand volume of 0 0.328, then its weight will be approx 
531.36 kg or 11.58 CFT after doing volume conversion. So dear engineers, by this way anyone can easily calculate the motor ratio of 1 is to 6 ratio for plastering work. So that's it for today. I hope you will got a clear idea about the plaster quantity calculation. Perhaps if you have any questions or queries or any suggestion, please let me know in the comment box. Thanks for sticking with Civil Unboxing channel. Please do like, share and subscribe to this channel. Thanks a million. See you soon in the next upcoming one.